Good afternoon to all respected sir and my dear friend. Uh, before I start my presentation, uh, I want to say that once, of, once upon a time uh, we sleep in the lap of grandmother and grandfather with a story, uh, with a interesting story. So uh, that moment to leads us to adultness. So uh, my presentation uh, normally we make uh, uh, like a typical matter, but today I, I not made this type of. Uh, now I am going to uh, focus on my topic. So I am going to present Harry Potter and the children and literature. So at the end of the presentation, we have a question that uh, uh, Harry Potter is a really a children literature or not. So let's start. Uh, Madeline Langdon said that you have to write the book that wants to be written and if the book will be too difficult for grown-ups, then you write it for the children. So normally uh, the writer wrote on specific uh, uh, genre or on the specific uh, audience. So normally the book write for the grown-up is called the uh, children. Uh, now here I mentioned that the first children magazine in 1873, the Nicholas magazine was published. So uh, during that time, uh, a lot of uh, story published uh, in the uh, Nicholas magazine also. Uh, generally during that time, uh, journal like fiction, non uh, multiple literature, poetry, and uh, traditional literature. Uh, some kind of like a uh, picture book, uh, fantasy fiction, uh, traditional, and folk tale, fairy tale, uh, etc. Uh, so I start my uh, presentation with characteristic of uh, children's literature. So before I start, I want to share that uh, what is children's literature. So uh, normally children literature uh, written for child, kids, and uh, um, which is a uh, appeal to children and kids also. So there are the concept of the child uh, When we we are uh, uh, we are uh, at the level of child at that time we doing some kind of like uh, destroying the things and uh, crying, quarreling. So in the children's situation, uh, writers uh, normally focus on the uh, children's uh, uh, children's behavior and problem also. So in the Harry Potter, uh, in the uh, during uh, uh, opening series that uh, the Harry Potter, uh, Potter and Ron, Hermione, they are uh, described as children and they all are behave like a children. And uh, children, uh, we can find that the children literature has uh, everywhere children, and normally they are uh, protagonists, like child protagonists. In the Harry Potter, the uh, opening series of the Harry Potter, that uh, the uh, all the characters describe as a child, and also appealing for the children. Uh, I think in the uh, opening series, the second way portrayed Harry Potter as an evil and year old. So one of the uh, characteristic is the concept of sight. Uh, then action. Uh, we like sight because uh, they are cute, but uh, they can't uh, see quietly because uh, they, they have not proper manner to how to behave and how to work. So children understand the uh, feeling, emotion of the uh, parents and society. Uh, correct, uh, this type of children character don't just sit around and sad all day. They doing some kind of adventure and uh, like uh, anything. So they never sit on the one place. Uh, then fantastic. In the Harry Potter we can find that lot of uh, a creature of fantastic imagination of the animals, uh, ghost story, flashback, 
uh, unreal world. So that type of fantasy lead to uh, children to read and watch the movie also. So fantasy is a uh, one of the best uh, characteristic of the uh, uh, children literature. Uh, another way, another way we can say that uh, uh, normally. Uh, children literature talk about uh, these animals uh, and it, its characters also like animals, birds and also this uh, is poker. So it not happen in real world. But uh, prior also mentioned all the things uh, over the way. Uh, next character is uh, innocence. Uh, we know that uh, science is uh, uh, another reflection of God. And uh, they all are normally innocent because they have not uh, 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 understand that what and how to do. But uh, when they grew up, at that time they lost sometimes uh, innocence about you. Uh, they also learn what good about that innocence and what dangerous about it. And they get answered through the account, encountering how things and uh, new peoples. So they learn from us. So I suggest that uh, sometimes uh, children learn from the parents. So don't do everything in front of sight. So uh, next is the optimism. Uh, one thing notice that uh, uh, how things always end happily uh, ever after in the children book. When we grow up, when may we realize that life doesn't easy or happy because we have uh, some, kind, some kind of problem in our life. So our, our life never ends with happy. But in the Harry Potter we can find that uh, uh, Harry finds love with Ginny and uh, then after the end of the series they marriage uh, and they, they have a child after nine years. Uh, the scene that uh, they have a child and they uh, uh, go to uh, oh God and that way. So that will happen in real life also. Uh, next is uh, illustration. So illustration helps to keep kids attention and stimulation their uh, imagination. Some children books are uh, like only picture and after that uh, thousands of words, words of description. So sometimes that type also, also happens. <coughs> Uh, next is children's life movement. So during the time of uh, 70, 60 and 80, 40, the in, uh, industrial revolution in Britain, which uh, in front of uh, uh, industrial uh, boss or uh, master, uh, which is a uh, do work by the children. So they, they work against. But generally, we notice that uh, children have a question. They are to be the adult. But uh, uh, normally we can find that uh, adults have no question. They keep uh, um, freely and enjoy the life, don't ask questions. So he's normally high with that. Uh, then, now my presentation go to uh, another way that uh, uh, it's very really the uh, Harry Potter book is uh, typical or not. So uh, it is not a based on the children book, but it is a book of grow up and uh, we also grow up with the uh, Harry Potter series. We literally uh, grew up with the books. Uh, then the series is just deep themes. In the Harry Potter we can find that uh, there are so many themes like uh, nature of evil, power of love, uh, value of life, uh, post of power, sacrifice, friend, family. So that type of so many type of uh, themes uh, revealed in the Harry Potter, uh, which may be not represented in the health, uh, children literature also. Then plot of character. So, uh, in the Harry Potter, uh, so many characters, and maybe we will uh, relate during the reading the book and watching the film. Uh, one of the things is that uh, there are not a 
spread for a character like poor or evil. Uh, because the both sides have uh, some kind of power and some kind of logic to do everything. Uh, then the humor is witty and creative. In the Harry Potter, you can find that uh, uh, there is not a shocking or even like a normally laughing, but they have laughed uh, for specific uh, uh, intelligent uh, and critical uh, way that uh, this type of uh, matter and they laugh. Then, medical creation uh, aren't what we have uh, expected. There are there were discovered that a uh, lot of uh, magical creatures like animals and uh, dancing gender <coughs> and also so uh, the correct uh, magical creature create uh, some kind of uh, interest to read the children's literature. Generally, in the children's literature, uh, writer. Uh, use the magical creature for uh, like a sweet and very helpful. But in the Harry Potter we can find that some magical creature very hunted or uh, some kind of mysterious characters also. So uh, that's the difference. Uh, the hero gives up a lot. Uh, in some children books uh, ending like perfectly. No one died or nobody that. But in the Harry Potter, uh, one moment, uh, one moment in the Harry Potter that uh, the uh, Harry Potter ready to give his soul at the time, our heart beat uh, up and down. That what happened now? So uh, in the Harry Potter, hero give up a lot, uh, including his soul also, and the uh, parental figure are realistic. This media portrayed parents as a perfect and knowing all the answers. And the Harry Potter goes uh, quietly and tried to know that uh, who is my parent and uh, what happened with him. So uh, he has a curiosity to know the parent figure. Now, uh, the books inspire so much more. So it is not the only the children literature and talk and story and listen and enjoy the story. But it is the inspired of what? Uh, this book also given a moral message also and a critical way they talking about the religions and uh, children literature also. So the book is inspired of what? And uh, a royal plot more than what on the page. That uh, this book are normally pretty or straight forward. Uh, they begin and end with the font and text color. But uh, in the Harry Potter, you can show that every page has a own, own, uh, uh, own uh, important or own uh, strength of the, of the story. So at the end, I have to say that uh, is Harry Potter typical children literature book, literature and books or not? Can you say that uh, particular or specific specific way that uh, this is a uh, children literature book? So this is a reference. This is a question, so you can ask.